What's up beautiful people? Welcome back to another reaction video. Like the title says, in this one we're gonna be reacting to Weekly's after school music video. Weekly is back. One of my favorite groups that debuted in 2020 has already their third comeback, which is insane because like it's not even been a year and they already had three comebacks, so they really are putting out content, which I think is the right move as a debuting group that really, you know, putting out the content, really reeling in your new fans in the first two to three years, you know what I mean? To really solidify the fan base and solidify their style of songs, their place in the K-pop industry. I heard already one music video teaser, saw already one music video teaser and I thought it's gonna be actually the one song that is gonna be more in my lane because if I'm being honest, Tag Me, Freaking Addictive is actually not really my type of genre, my type of K-pop that I listen to a lot, but there's just something so addictive to that song that I just couldn't help but fall in love with. But then Zigzag wasn't really my thing. And then I heard now a little snippet from After School and I was like, Ooh, Ooh, they're going into a little bit more of my direction, um, what I like to listen to. So uh, freaking excited. So without much further ado, let's just go ahead and watch the weekly after school music video. School's out. So we're starting already with that. Dope, dope, dope. Oh my God. Kind of is really fast. That slideshow. <laughs> Okay, still having the cutesy vibe in there, of course. <laughs> Cute. Really have to say, really subtle start. Like, I can hear the melody of, I feel like the chorus already, that da da da. Da, 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 da. I feel like that's gonna go into a bigger forefront in the chorus drop, but it's really subtle and I love kind of the storytelling going on in the lyrics, like really kind of first person perspective, maybe even like as if they are talking to us and be like, hey, we said we're gonna meet up now. Where are you? I think that's really, really cool. So let's see where the chorus is gonna take us. And Ooh. <laughs> Cute. Hey. <laughs> Sorry. That was way too cute. <laughs> One thing that I wanted to say before that drop came in really kind of, not threw me off, but really surprised me was um, that I love that they are kind of mixing still that bubbly, quirky, cutesy, a little bit popish sound with a little bit more of a hip hop influence the hip-hop but is really really subtle like I, it's not too much like it's not a total switch up a 180 to their two other comebacks two other songs that they had till now so i really love that little step-by-step -step evolution into maybe a new direction or maybe just with that one showing a little bit of a different side to them that they can do and that line that zigzag something something let's dance something something that was <laughs> also that um Gian is doing that line is just it just fits like it fits also with her character so i freaking love that little line right there <laughs> It kind of reminds me a little bit of Dion's line in uh, Like It, you know, that went viral <laughs> because it's so cheesy. <laughs> okay, okay, so uh, okay, okay. I see. <laughs> Chian is just the cutest baby out there, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> I 
and oh they can they can oh okay 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 they can skateboard okay okay i see you i see you respect for them just went high real up because i was like a skateboard fanatic too in my earlier days i didn't step on a skateboard for like five years now but like in my teens i was pretty pretty heavy on skateboarding i tried to go into half pipes and stuff like that too but uh, that was that a little bit too much i just used skateboard to just cruise around and go to school and stuff i love the song a lot it's like i said it's a lot in my lane but i love also still that poppy really poppy feeling in the song and kind of that the chorus is that melodic too you know what i mean like that it's not going into a drop or something like that like i really love that it's the way they sing it it's kind of slower than the pace of the song and really melodic i don't know how else to describe it <laughs> cute Oh, vocal tone, that little deeper, okay. Oh, one day coming through. That smile, come on, man. That's one in a million right there. She and Smile is one in a million. Come on. <laughs> that cat was kind of random. <laughs> Ooh, in the clouds, yeah. looking really really cute really really fresh i wanted to say too um but then i was like man fresh is kind of i never used that adjective i never used fresh as an adjective so um or at least for like appearances so i kind of was I'm still weirded out that I used it now fresh. This one, I really do like it. I really, like I said, love the chorus that like kind of slowed down um, melodic singing that they do over actually a pretty faster beat than um, their singing. Also that little <laughs> quirky rap part right there just fits, you know, like it's really addictive. I feel like this song will have the same vibe and feeling and addictiveness like Likey had, you know, like it has that poppy sound but then that break up into a little bit of a rap part which just is so quirky that you can't help but um, probably know in and out by the end <laughs> of the song so uh, yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this little reaction right here let me know down in the comments below what you guys thought of weekly's after school I hope you guys have an amazing day be safe and don't forget to subscribe like and I will see you guys on the next one Peace. Drowning out our sorrows, holy water, lost that sweet. Stacking all this water, I might cop a supper.